Okay, if you look over to the left, lining up and coming in, one of America's best, the P-40. He's been flown by his owner, Peter Teichmann, who is a committed warbird collector. I'm not sure if he's got his Spitfire yet, but he wants one. Meanwhile, this is very nice to be going on with, I think. widely accepted that the RAF had four legendary fighters during World War II, which brought them the ultimate victory for the Allies. First, of course, is the Supermarine Spitfire, and then the P-51 Mustang. But another of these greats is the unique Curtis P-40 Kitty Hawk. successful in the Western Desert. Capable of 380 mile an hour, 10,000 feet, six guns in the wings. And she can carry 500 pounds of bombs. 
I don't know if you noticed as she flew over them that the wheels lie flat back in the undercarriage bays under the wing. Uh, and so that as the, the wheels are retracted, they rotate through 90 degrees. It's quite a complicated system, but you can see the butt end of the undercarriage leg sticking slightly forward of the wing. Lining up for another attacking pass, the Curtis P-40. You'll notice that it says U.S. Army under those wings. Navy or Army? Curling background, pulling the G on, stuffing the nose down. A nice low pass, showing the top surface of those wings. Archer. I think that is goodbye to Peter Teichmann.